Arizona State wins the opener against NAU 40 to 3. Welcome into the post game. I'm Eliov Goodbye with Jordan Ham and Jordy, we weren't going to get all our questions answered today, but we did get a few answered, one of them being Emory Jones's comfort within the offense. What did you see? Yeah, I, like you said, just a lot of comfort, um, an offensive line ahead of him that he hadn't really worked with a ton, but it's a group that has a lot of college football experience and only gave up one sack the entire night kept him upright for the most part. Uh, Herm Edwards mentioned in the run game, he'd like to see Emery get, a, get down a little bit earlier, not take so many hits. Yeah. Um, and that's something when you're going up against Oklahoma State next week, you you want to avoid. But um, overall, it was a good mix. We, we kind of saw the full Emery Jones on display where it was very efficient passing. They didn't really need to take that many shots. Um, and then in the run game, whether it was X Valade, whether it was Daniel Angata, whether it was Emory Jones, they really got the ball moving. Mm -hmm. Now, when it comes to Emory Jones, Coach Herm Edwards said that he loved how collective and calm he was, right? On the other end, I can say the same for his defensive leaders, mm -hmm. right? Obviously, Merlin Robertson, uh, namely. When it comes to that side of the ball, what did you see? Yeah, exact same thing. The defensive line got in the backfield. Kevin Daniels is a really good running back that we've seen at the high school level. Had a great year last year for NAU. They shut him down. They shut Drayson Hall down. Hendricks Johnson is a big target mm -hmm. and they were able to limit what he was doing. So uh, the secondary completely new. No Jordan Clark. No to Marcus yeah. Davis. Uh, it really didn't feel like there were a lot of big plays happening. Um, so that, that was really good to see uh, if you're a Sun Devil fan. And Coach Herm Edwards also mentioned that they were playing pretty vanilla on both sides of the ball. Obviously, OK State, the bigger picture, if you will, coming up next week. Did you see that from ASU as well? Totally. It was, if it ain't broke, don't fix it. Yeah. And I, what I said before the game was, I think for Herm Edwards, if he had it his way, Emory Jones was throwing the ball 12 times. And it was just run it, pick up four yards of carry, keep churning the clock. It's pretty much what they did. I don't think they really showed too much. Um, you know, Messiah Swinson stepped up really nicely in the past game. Um, he's already showing the type of target that he can be. Andre Johnson was targeted a lot. Um, so I think those could be two guys that uh, help solidify the passing game a little bit more. But yes, they are going to show all their cards before a big opponent on the road against Oklahoma State in Stillwater. Well, obviously a fun one tonight. ASU takes care of business decisively with OK State coming up next week. For Jordan Ham, I'm Eliov. Goodbye.